All right, so my guy Iceman has some versus matches, and he's got some pretty unique ones going on, so let's take a look at them. Make sure you guys go to his page, check out his work. He does amazing content, but let's get to it. First one up is going to be Uranos versus Darkseid. And this is a banger match of the big baddies. We all know who Darkseid is and what he brings to the table with the Omega Beams. However, Uranos is a little bit of a secret or underdog. But don't sleep on this guy, because if we remember, this guy was able to tank a blast from Cable and a futuristic weapon that was supposed to be like some type of ultimate destruction, and this guy shrugged it off with no problem. And then his fight with Legion, you know, that Legion who's folding time and space like nothing, Uranos was able to take him out. So this isn't going to be an easy battle for either one of them, but if Uranos is supposed to be stronger than Thanos, I'm sorry, I'm going Uranos, man, in the upset. Next battle is going to be Quasar versus Superman. And while this battle might look a little bit lopsided on the surface, you guys got to learn about Quasar. Because if Superman gives this man any amount of time, he's going to do to Superman like he does to all his other opponents and drain him in an instance. Couple that with Quasar's abilities to enhance his strength with his quantum bands, he's not going to be a pushover. Nonetheless, he's going against the big blue in Superman, and Superman's too fast, too strong, too durable, so Quasar is going to take the L. Next one up is going to be Vulcan versus General Zod. And we know General Zod, he's just a more aggressive Superman on a lower strength level. Unfortunately for that, it's going to cost General Zod because Falcon is going to take him out. I can see him doing a similar thing as what he did to Gladiator just recently. Because General Zod is a being that relies on energy and a power source. And guess what Vulcan does best? Absorb that and use it against him. So give me Vulcan. Next battle is going to be Nova Prime versus Martian Manhunter. And this battle is cool, but it's nothing that Nova Prime hasn't taken on before. Nova has a defense for one of Martian Manhunter's greatest abilities, his telepathy. As well as Nova has taken on characters just as strong or stronger than Martian Manhunter before and done pretty well. With the totality of the Nova Force and the world mind on this side, give me Richard Ryder. Last battle is going to be Champion versus Orion. And this one is an absolute monster battle. Orion with the Mother Box and Astro Force and then Champion with the Power Stone. What a crazy battle, but the Champion brings some real abilities to the table. This guy has fought every warrior in the universe pretty much and has world shattering strength. Couple that with the Power Stone makes him a match that I don't know if Orion can take on. Champion has taken on people like Thor and so much more. He's an absolute beast. But the war dog is the man. Unfortunately, DC's played him currently, but we're gonna go with the overall one. Orion has rage that is unmatched that has made him take on the Man of Steel himself. As well as him bringing the Astro Force or control of the Astro Force, that dude's a problem, and I, I'm honest with you, man. I think it's a 50-50, kind of, but I think I'm going to go with Orion for the win, man. He's too flexible, too strong, and just that mother box gives him the edge. However, you guys let me know what you think. These battles are bangers, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Take it easy.